I heard one girl call herself steak because she was mouthwatering and she liked big potatoes. So what is a butch lesbian to you? Butch lesbian is the opposite of a lipstick lesbian. Baggy pants. Walk in a more dominant masculine manner. Like a girl who's gonna pull up in her car and just like take you away. Fuck the car, she's riding a motorcycle. <laughs> they're definitely masculine, they're a little bit they're both well, you know, you know what I mean. You know what I mean. Spiky and sync circa 1998 hair. Justin Bieber eyebrows. I don't know what she's doing right now. So, what is the most ridiculous nickname a butch lesbian has given herself? Toolbox. Slacks. I've never heard them call them anything. The rhino. Oh, the screwdriver. I heard one girl call herself steak because she was mouthwatering and she liked big potatoes. Okay, I, you should never give yourself a nickname. And don't tell your friends to give you the nickname. Nicknames should always come to you. I feel like these butch lesbians make their own nicknames. What does the term butch in the streets, femme in the sheets mean? Oh, the butches are always the softest lovers. Butch in the streets, femme in the sheets means that they appear to be very, very butch. And when you get in the bedroom, they turn into a pillow princess. They will not go down on you. They're gonna expect you to do all the work. It's like the age old riddle. What's hard on the outside and soft on the inside? A butch lesbian. That's that's the answer. That's the answer. Why do you think so many straight girls love butch women? I don't know if this is offensive, but I'm gonna say because it's the closest you can get to a guy without actually having to deal with a guy. They assume that they will do all the work in bed. It's like the it's like the best of both worlds, basically. You get the girl because you know what you want, you know. But then you also get a little bit of a guy there. I feel like that's what it is. Confidence. The confidence. They have confidence. The confidence where they're like, I can pick you up with one hand and walk you through the door. And, and into my bedroom. Chris Bay. So a lot of butch women have certain rules while dating you or while in the bedroom. What are some of those rules? You can't use her hair gel. I guess don't act manly. <laughs> Don't act manly. I guess there can only be one man, right? Never insult her cat marbles. What's the one thing about butch lesbians that most people would never guess? They like talking about their feelings. Some suck at sports. Like sometimes they tell me that I'm a little too insensitive. Those girls that seem kind of feminine, but deep down inside they're actually really butch. They're like the hidden butch. Some are bisexual. Uh, well, word on the street is that they actually aren't loud in the bedroom. They're actually super, super quiet. Visit your local lesbian bar to find a butch woman and learn more about these fascinating, beautiful creatures. Thank you guys so much for watching. You can watch the other videos in the Lesbians Explained series by clicking the playlist down below. Go and check out the other girls in this video. They will be linked on the right and down below also. And if you want to see a butch lesbians talking about feminine lesbians, you might want to go and click the like button. I will see you guys next Sunday.